I think the, the Spitfire thing was around because our, our dad's always been into Spitfires and recently been reading a lot of books on Spitfires. So I think that we were very aware of the Spitfire and we thought there's, there's bound to be some good stories attached to the Spitfires because those pilots, I mean, not only were they incredibly brave, but there's so many colourful characters. The one name that pops out was Spitfire Paddy. And I think that resonated with us mm. because of the Irish connection and the fact that it's an Irishman flying for the RAF. Have you any idea what they'd say back home if they found out that one of Andy Finucane's boys was thinking of joining the British? This is what I want to do. I want to fly. It was important for us to get the blessing of the living relatives. So when we uh, decided we wanted to do this film, we reached out to the family and said, we want to make this movie. We love the area, we love Birmingham, we love the Birmingham people and the Worcestershire people have come out and helped us. We had 140 actors on this. Yeah, and actors about, and extras, yeah. And about 60 crew in the end. It took us by surprise initially, didn't it, how big it was, you know, it was going to yeah. be. It's like going to a firework display with only one rocket <laughs> yeah. and, then and then suddenly realising where's, where's the next bang or flash coming from. Those people can't all be wrong. It's just an extra puff of wind in our sails to say that we've got a cracking movie here. For us, the validation is obviously some of the awards that's been picking up. Uh, I think that for us is, is validating yeah. that, that we've done something right with the project. It's all worth fighting for, isn't it? We, we, we've, done, we've done Brendan Pride. Just giving it a little spit and polish, sir.